What's up guys, today's video is about the top 5 best submersible pump for septic tank of this year through extensive research and testing to put together a list of options. So what are the price, performance, and particular use for more information on the products? Do I have to include the links in the description box below which is updated for the best prices? Like the video. Do comment and don't forget to subscribe. Now let's get started number 1. Wayne RPP 50 Cast Iron Sewage Pump With its durable construction and large intake, this sewage pump is well suited for nasty conditions. The one half horsepower motor is capable of moving up to 103 gallons of water per minute at 5 feet of head. The 2-inch discharge fits standard plumbing and produces enough suction to handle solids up to 2 inches in diameter. A wide base and heavy cast iron construction it weighs 21 pounds keeps this pump upright while allowing it to endure harsh conditions. A large float switch automatically shuts off the pump when the water level drops to 7.5 inches to prevent burning out the pump motor. At 14 inches tall, 9.5 inches wide, and 6 inches deep, this pump is suitable for use in sewage basins as small as 18 inches in diameter. Product Specs Horsepower 1 half HP flow rate, 103 GPM at 5 feet. Material, cast iron. Pros heavy cast iron housing with a powder coat finish. Pumps 103 gallons per minute. Semi-open impellers can pass solids up to 2 inches. Maximum height of 25 feet. Cons expensive. Handles sewage but won't grind solids. Number 2. Superior Pump Cast Iron Sewage Pump Durable construction and a high output make this sewage pump a worthy option. This one half horsepower pump will move a respectable 4,800 gallons per hour at even height with an impressive maximum vertical height of 25 feet. And while it may not have the same flow rate as higher end pumps, this model impresses with the quality of its construction. It features cast iron construction for durability and a black coating that protects the housing from rust and corrosion. The cast aluminum impeller is stronger than the plastic impellers that other models use, making it better able to grind through potential clogs while also lasting longer. This pump, which can handle solids up to 2 inches in diameter, is average in size at 9.75 inches long, 16.75 inches high, and 9 inches wide. Product Specs Horsepower, 1 half HP flow rate, 80 GPM at 5 feet. Material, cast iron. Pros rust and corrosion resistant cast iron construction. Cast aluminium impeller, grinds larger objects. Moves 4,800 gallons per hour. Maximum height of 25 feet. Cons limited gallons per minute. Heavy. Number 3. Zoller sewage pump. This model, from one of the oldest names in sewage pumps, may be an investment, but a durable build and high-performance motor make it worth it. The cast iron construction gives this pump a confidence-inspiring, heavy-duty feel right out of the box. It's equipped with a non-clogging impeller that easily passes solid waste. A one half horsepower motor has a flow rate of 128 gallons per minute at a height of 5 feet and will pump out waste to a maximum height of 21.5 feet if needed. Its discharge valve will pass solids up to 2 inches in diameter. A float switch automatically turns the pump off and on, depending on the water level. This model also includes an automatic shutoff if the pump runs dry, preventing damage. The Zoller 2670001 is 11 inches long, 13.6 inches wide, and 16 inches high. Product Specs Horsepower, 1 half HP flow rate 128 GPM at 5 feet. Material, cast iron. Pros cast iron construction, completely submersible. Moves up to 128 gallons per minute. Non-clogging impeller for solid objects. Automatic shutoff and float switch features. Cons. Does not grind objects or sewage. Expensive. Number 4. Liberty Sewage Pump. Solid cast iron construction and a powerful motor make this model from Liberty one of the more powerful models on the market, its one half horsepower motor pumps out 160 gallons per minute to a height of 5 feet. 
A float switch turns on the pump when the water level is between 12 inches and 16 inches and turns it off when it falls below 6 inches from the bottom of the basin, while its impeller and discharge can handle solids up to 2 inches in diameter. This model also features a quick connect design with the power cord, which allows the user to replace the cord if worn without having to rewire the unit. The pump housing has a powder coat finish, which protects the pump from rust and corrosion. This pump is comparable in size to other sewage pumps at 11.5 inches long, 9 inches wide, and 16 inches high. Product Specs Horsepower, 1 half HP flow rate, 160 GPM at 5 feet. Material, cast iron. Pros high flow rate. Solid cast iron construction. Replaceable power cord. Cons expensive. Number 5. Rainbro Submersible Sewage Pump. With a max flow rate of 100 gallons per minute and sturdy construction, the Rainbro is a suitable choice for most sewage basins and can pump to a max height of 20 feet. In addition to a high flow rate, it's well built with a cast iron housing and a discharge that's capable of handling solids up to 2 inches in diameter. It's also smaller than other sewage pumps at 16 inches high and 10 inches wide. A float switch cuts power when the water level is below 11 inches and turns the pump on when sewage reaches a height of 21 inches. The float switch can also be adjusted to alter when it turns off and on. Product Specs Horsepower, 1 half HP flow rate, 100 GPM at 5 feet. Material, cast iron. Pros adjustable float switch. Good flow rate. Cast iron housing. Cons expensive. If you enjoy this video, like the video, hit the subscribe button and press the bell icon for more interesting videos like this.